Hi, I'm Kelly with CitrusCycles.ca. I'm here with the Boar uh, electric fat bike from Surface 604, the Vancouver company, and I'm uh, doing a beach test. If you haven't checked out the other videos at CitrusCycles.ca yet, you might want to do that. We have a video review of the Boar in general, a long-term uh, review and some uh, trail rides as well. But as you can see, uh, soft sand is not a problem. You get the uh, air pressure down on your tires, maybe uh, 8 or 10 psi. You can go as low as 5 psi with the uh, tires that are on here. And that gives you a lot of stability and a lot of traction in soft sand like this. There's really no problems at all. Now we're moving towards some uh, harder pack sand. And I'll double back here and you can actually see, if you look very closely, you can see the uh, tread from my bike and you can see it. It really is remarkable at how little impact it does have on very soft sand and that's due to those very large tires. But the great thing about an electric fat bike is that you're not worried about overcoming that huge uh, rolling resistance that uh, you're going to find in a typical fat bike. You can, on a beach for example, just use level one and it gives you just that little bit of uh, assist that you need to keep you moving. And you can see I've got some decent speed going on here on the beach. Coming up to some water here, the nice thing about the bore uh, from Surface 604 is they have used a lot of quality components. So we've got a sealed bottom bracket, things like that. So I'm not actually too concerned about getting uh, sand or salt water in my bike. Of course, any time you've uh, done a beach ride like this, you want to give your bike a good cleaning to avoid any problems in the future.
it can get a little bit bumpy on some of the uh, big rocks that are coming up here. But with the uh, lower air pressure, it's uh, not a big problem. Of course, with the bore, you can actually choose to upgrade to a full suspension fork with the uh, RST Renegade. And if you're frequently riding on uh, rocks like that, that might be a good idea.